Take your hands behind your legs and round yourself up to an upright position. In this series of next exercises, we're going to be using the ball. So take your ball, sit up tall, and just keep it in your hand to begin with. And make sure your band is out of the way. Put the heel and the ball of your foot and toe together in front so you see a diamond shape with your legs. And it's not going to be a scrunched up diamond shape, but make it a nice long marquee diamond shape with the feet so it's extended out. Now press on the heel, the ball of the foot and your toe. Put some energy there so you feel the energy running up and into your center. And keep pressing there if you can. Sit up tall. Relax the shoulders. Now the ball is in front of you. And just have your arms parallel with a gentle press on the ball. Take a breath in. As you exhale, round the tail, tuck under, hollow out your belly, and roll just a few inches down. Take a breath in, and make sure on the return you round yourself up on this exercise coming up. Take a breath in again. Shoulders are relaxed, arms are relaxed, but gentle pressure on the ball as you roll down. Breathe in. Exhale to round yourself back up and sitting up tall. We're going to roll down a little further this time, rolling down, still keeping energy pressed to the heels, the ball, the feet, and the toes. The arms are going to come overhead. We pick up the arms, head and shoulders to round, pull the belly in, round yourself forward this time, and sit upright and lengthen to the top. Once again, as you exhale to round down and scoop, you're still pushing energy through the feet. Arms come overhead. Pick up the arms, head and shoulders to round and scoop, pull the belly in, try not to make it a jerky motion. We'll do this one more time. To roll down, pull the belly in, rolling down, arms overhead, picking up the arms, head and shoulders as you round, scoop forward, and sit up tall. Now we're taking the ball and moving it to the inner thighs to give a little alignment and some extra work and resistance for the bridging we're about to do. Scoot yourself forward and make sure the ball is secure between your thighs as you roll down. Lengthen through the neck and be tall to the top of your head as you place your hands down. Your feet should be about hip joint width apart, still squeezing on the ball and we're going to take a breath in. Exhale, scoop and tuck your pelvis so your tail goes up towards the ceiling, sky, and up, take a breath in again. Exhale to peel down, vertebra by vertebra. Take a breath in again. Exhale to scoop and pick up, lifting tailbone and pubic bone up towards the sky. Shoulders are relaxed back, breathe in at the top, and exhale, peel down, vertebra by vertebra, really lengthening through the tail all the way down. Now making sure when you get to the bottom, you release to a neutral spine position, tail is long, and on your exhale, you scoop and tuck under, lift up, still squeezing with the inner thighs on that ball, breathing in at the top. Exhale to lower down once more, and as you lower, sink your sternum down into your rib cage as you peel down. Let it be nice and heavy. Take a breath in, we're gonna scoop and pick up once more, lifting up, holding here. Now just stabilize yourself, shoulders are back, you're long through the neck, you're squeezing on the ball, everything's in alignment. You have a nice steady drawbridge with the ribs funneling towards your pelvis. Now we're gonna take a breath in and do eight little squeezes with the ball. Squeeze eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, breathe in. And on the exhale, peel down again, still sinking that sternum down into the rib cage, peeling, lengthening. Go to neutral position with the spine, and exhale, scoop up, picking up. We're going to do the squeezes one more time. Begin with the breath in, though. Now exhaling. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Breathing in. Exhale to peel down, all the way down. Draw the knees into your chest. Now take the ball and place it between the ankles above the feet. Let your legs come down towards the floor. We're not quite finished with the bridging yet. Now the ball should be secure between your ankles and your feet are facing away from you in parallel. Take a breath in again. Exhale, scoop up, lift up. Tail and pubic bone up towards the sky, holding there. And now pick up the heels and make sure that your feet are not so far away from you that you can't do this lifting up. You need to have them tucked in enough not to strain the knees. Picking up, lifting up, breathing in, exhale to lower. This ball here gives you a nice alignment, keeps everything in line and lowering the heels down. Picking up again, shoulders are away and back, keeping the belly pulled in, but your ankles are not rolling out or rolling in, it keeps steady. You have to work right through the second big toe, big toe and the second toe, lowering down. We're going to do one more. Roll through the foot. Keep it long. Lower the heels. Take a breath in. 
Exhale, peel down one more time. Now we're drawing the legs up to a 90 degree angle. Keep squeezing on the ball with the ankles. We lower the knees to one side and return back to center. Drop them down on the other side and return back to center. Lower again, breathing in. Exhale to return. Lowering down and back. We do one more each way, making sure you keep the back of the opposite rib down as you roll so you're not rolling so far as to lose your stability. Extend the legs up. We'll take this a notch further, lowering the legs down, keeping control through your center and returning back. Breathing in. The exhale, drawing the navel in and returning. Once more each way with this one and returning. And other side, exhale to return. We'll take this a stage further. Take the legs to the side once more, add a small circle around and back and now we reverse. Legs to the side, around and back and circle. Breathe in, exhale to sweep back and stabilize. Breathe in as it goes away. We'll do one more both ways. Breathe in and it's around and back, keeping stable in your center, long in the neck as well and belly pulled in and hold. Bend at the knees, curl your head and shoulders up. Keep the knees at 90 and your tail in, in long and your spine is in neutral. Take the arms overhead, breathing in. Exhale, scoop it around, stick with it. Breathing in, arms overhead and exhale around. Now we're gonna add a little extension with the legs, just a little one breathing in, keeping the belly pulled in and come back to tuck in. Let's do two more, pushing out. Don't let the belly pop up, keep it down and return. And one more, pushing up, breathing in and coming back. Now, keeping the legs there, keeping tucked in, take the, the ball and just put it between the thighs while we're on the back. Hands go around your, your shins and just give a little rock. We'll rock and roll and we'll come up. Secure it a little more if you need to. Sitting up tall, we're gonna do rolling like a ball here with the ball between the thighs. Make a little rounding through your belly. Shoulders are relaxed, you have that nice C curve going on with the spine. And just roll back and come up. Stay nice and steady. Breathe in, exhale to roll up. If you can, try to hover on the top so you're getting better and steadying as you go along. And let's just do two more. Breathing in, exhaling up. One last time, stay with it. Great job.